Hello everyone, welcome to iNetwork365. And in this video, what I'm going to show you is that if you are facing any difficulty in adding your Gmail account to your Outlook, so this will be the right video for you. So here you can see that I'll open my Outlook. And here I'm going to enter my email address. And next I will add, enter my password. And here you can see it is asking for my password even though when I enter the correct password still it requires to enter my password again. But if I click OK, still it will remain the same. So what I have to do, I have to go to my uh, web browser. So I'm going to open my Google Chrome. And from here, I will log into my Gmail. OK. So from here what I'm going to do, I'm going to click uh, on the button over here and I'll click on manage your Google account. Then I'll click on security. Then scroll down. And here you can see uh, my two step verification is turned off. So what I have to do, I have to enable this option. So I will click on my two step verification. So I'll scroll down click get started and here I'll type my uh, password then next I will enter my number over here and I'll click next so now I will receive a uh, the verification code to my number so I mean to my phone so I should enter here okay so click on turn on okay so go back again scroll down and now you can see there's an option called app password so here click on this and again enter the password of your gmail account okay so here what you have to do you have to select select app and from here select mail then is asking select device so I'll click on here and in here select Windows computer because you're going to add in your Windows computer then click on generate and here you can see it will generate a password so copy this password copy this password and paste it over here click OK And you can see it is my, my Gmail account is successfully added to my Outlook. So I'll click on OK. So now it will start downloading my emails. And also one more thing let me show you before I end this video. Again I'll go back. In case if you already have two-step verification on so in that case you don't need to reconfigure it, reconfigure it again so what you have to do you have to click straight away click on app, app password and do the thing which I have done earlier okay so that's all about this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it so until next time please subscribe share and like my video thank you